Okay, so here's FileZilla. On the left side, you have your computer. On the right side, we have our server side. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to upload our robots.txt. Okay, now let me just show you something that somebody can do and how we can prevent them from doing so. Let's open up our browser here. And then let's go to that domain slash robot.txt. Okay, so this happens to be on the domain online teaching videos.com and we'll type in robots dot txt okay now you see what has happened here it, they can view the robot dot text and find out where we've stored our files okay so what they could do is they could take this now copy this and then put it into their browser behind our main domain name so online teaching videos.com slash video slash video downloads okay and then if they key that into their browser and they hit enter it brings up whatever is in that directory okay there happens to be nothing in it at the moment because I just created it for this example but you see that they can actually see the content of your video downloads directory and they could swipe your files out of here so the easy way to fix that is to load up a blank index page into each of your directories that are in your robots.txt file. So what we would do is we would go into our download directory, okay, so video downloads within, within videos. And what we want to do in here is we want to upload a file called index.html with nothing in it. Okay, so what I would do is I would just create a text file. And it doesn't matter what you name it, you just name it index. So that's all we need to do is we'll open up Notepad and then we'll just save it. And we'll save it as index. Okay, and it's a text file, but that's okay. Now let's refresh this over here. Okay, and there's our index text file. So all you have to do is upload that. And then let's rename it over here. Just put htm on the end of it. Index.htm or html. htm is the best one to use. Okay, now let's go back here. And now let's refresh this page. Okay, as you can see, all you're going to do is get a blank page. So all you have to do is make sure that you do that every time. Just upload a blank index page like we did here into your download directory or whatever directory you're trying to protect from the search engines because they will be able to see your robots.txt and this will stop them from being able to get into the contents. So all of your other contents in here would be protected from the search engines and not visible to the public. So that's it. That's how you can protect your web pages from the search engines.